February the 4th, 2024, early in the morning hours, Clara Dato exited the store at 10,649 West Chicago to take the trash out when he saw multiple males attempting to steal his car. At least one of the males shoots uh, there, fatally wounding him. All the males, including the shooter, fled the scene in the suspect's car, which is a red Hyundai with silver rims and heavy front end damage, missing a bumper. Today, Thar's nephew is here to tell his story and to let the shooter know who it is they took away from him. The world has lost a great, loving man. Um, everyone in the family said uh, it's just been uh, horrible. And, um, you know, sometimes it leaves us speechless. Um, anytime anybody wanted help, he's there for them um, to help out. And, um, works, you know, he bought a new house uh, a couple of years ago, trying to build a new life in Michigan, working multiple jobs so hard, trying to provide for, for his family. And now we got a 16 year old teenager that's without a father, will grow up without a father, and a mother that lost her husband as well. Um, you know, please, to help out the family, um, call the 1-800 number, um, uh, speak up and uh, give us tips, um, you know, um, we need this, the person that did this need to be in jail, uh, not driving out, out there um, freely. The Chaldean American Chamber of Commerce and the Chaldean Community Foundation have engaged the Wa'ad Murad Fund in support of Mr. Tha'ar Dadu. Mr. Tha'ar Dadu, as was mentioned earlier, was killed in the parking lot of his part-time job on Saturday, February 3rd, leaving behind a grieving widow and a teenage son. The Wa'ad Murad Advocacy Fund was established in 2011 to aid the police in solving murders in the Chaldean business community. Since immigrating to the United States of America, more than 100 small business owners have been killed in their place of business in metropolitan Detroit. 100 Chaldean American business owners. The Wad Murad Advocacy Fund will award $10,000 to the supplier of information that leads to the arrest and conviction of the individuals who committed the murder. The reward works in conjunction with Crime Stoppers and the Detroit Police Department. The fund's aim is to bring justice to the perpetrators and hopefully some small relief to the victim's family. Anytime I needed him, you know, hey uncle, I needed, I need, you know, a drill for some reason, for, um, for example, he would just come and drop me that drill or, you know, what do you want to? What do you want? What do you want it to help with? And that's not just for me. His uncles, his friends, um, even far side family. Uh, he had a funeral in Iraq yesterday. Um, in Netherlands, I have a couple of aunts that came from Netherlands that just arrived a couple of days ago for, for his funeral yesterday. And yeah, this is this is how uh, loving this man is, and um, he was always there for everybody that needed him.